Because we already know Josh Freeman's out of a job, there are three reasons why the Buccaneers should fire Coach Greg Schiano. Number one, the guy's a PR disaster. Everything about the Josh Freeman situation has been handled poorly. By all means, bench a quarterback if he's not your guy. But don't ban him from the sidelines, don't evict him from the suite he rented for his friends and family, and don't leak confidential medical information, allegedly. All Greg Schiano's done is make it harder for the front office to trade a player that he doesn't want. Two, unhappy players. A Sports Illustrated report says that coaches and staff from Tampa Bay patrol the locker room and sidelines with video cameras to single out players that might be laughing or horsing around during losses. Sounds like fun. Add in the way the Buccaneers dive at opposing players' knees during kneel downs at the end of the game, and the way Darrell Rivas was angered with Shiano even before he played a single snap for the team. Ugh. Shiano might be the only coach that's as hated by opposing players as the ones that he coaches. And three, most importantly, results, or lack thereof. It's not just that the Bucks are 0-4, it's that they should be 3-1. They've lost three games where they've had a win probability percentage of 95% or more, with less than five minutes to play. Whether it's stupid, unnecessary roughness penalties or the wrong call on fourth down, each of those close losses has come down to bad coaching. So, PR disasters, unhappy players, and lousy results. Just three of the many reasons Greg Schiano should be fired. For more on this ongoing catastrophe, check out Bucks Nation on the SB Nation Network. We'll see you soon.